There may be times where you want to communicate directly with a specific group of people within your brigade, group or unit. Clusters may be made up of management teams like captains and crew leaders, or even be made up of support crews and catering staff. To create a communications cluster, you'll need to be an administrator. Start by logging into the members web app and then navigate to Administration, Broadcast Tags. Click on the new button in the top left hand side of the screen. Call your new broadcast tag Cluster Share. You'll want to make sure the default toggle is switched to off, but the messaging toggle is switched to on. Then click on Save and your new broadcast tag will be added to the list. Click on your Cluster Share broadcast tag and navigate to the Members tab. For each member you want to give access to the Cluster Share broadcast tag, ensure the View toggle is on and push notifications are set to All. When you're ready, click Save. Next, you want to set which members can send on the Cluster Share broadcast tag. Navigate to Administration Members. Click on a member that you would like to give send permissions to. Navigate to the Broadcast Tags tab at the top of the dialog box and find your Cluster Share tag. Use the toggle provided in the Send column and switch it to On. Do the same for each member that you would like to give send permissions to. Now you can communicate directly with your new cluster group. When you receive a new broadcast message, you can take action by tapping the thumbs up, thumbs down or other. The other option is generally defined by your brigade, group or unit. To add more detail about your other response, you can add a comment on the notification. To do this, Tap on the notification and then tap on the comments tab. Add your info into the text box provided, which can include text, a photo, an image already on your device and a location. Thanks for watching.